Next up on the ice, the 16-year-old from Fremont, California, Karen Chen, just getting things started on the senior level, but did so in the big way last year. Take a look at what people are saying about today's competition, Realtor.com, real-time update. So the Instagram from Karen Chen with her credential and Christy Yamaguchi, who's been a big influence on her skating, her life, sends this back. Best of luck, Karen. Same hometown, those two. That was the Realtor.com real-time update. What a moment for her, huh? At the Nationals last year, she surprised so many people capturing the bronze medal. So they wait for the numbers right now for Yulia Lipnitskaya. And one and change. Not even close. The next competitor represents the United States. A warm welcome for Karen Chen. Part of a family in figure skating. Her younger brother, Jeffrey, now involved in ice dance. But here is Karen Chen in fourth place after the short program. There are the numbers, what she would need to lead right now after this effort and her personal best at the bottom. Really started turning heads back in 2012 in the novice division. She won the title at the age of 12. And then last year, kept it all off the rise to the senior level with that bronze at the U.S. Nationals, her senior Grand Prix debut here. And she's so excited to be at this event, but her practices, she hasn't been making that much of a statement. She's struggling with the triples, lots of falls, lots of doubles. But in the short program, she was so determined. Hopefully she can do that in this free skate. Watch how big this opening triple lutz is. Almost too big, fell off her heel there on the landing, was going for a combination jump there. A triple triple. And this is the beginning of a series now in its 21st year, the Grand Prix, taking the top names all across the globe. Six events, and at the end, the top six in men's, ladies, dance, and pairs will make it to the Grand Prix final, which this season happens to take place in Barcelona. Heading into your first senior Grand Prix, you want to be very prepared, and both Karen and her coach have said, this plan has not worked. The last four months, she's gone through 14 pairs of boots. <laughs> she's had equipment issues that now have turned mental, I think, and it's really hard then to feel your jumps and get in the right rhythm. Have you ever heard of that, 14 pairs in four months? No. Beautiful double axle, half with triple sow cow. Very, very difficult jump sequence. highlight of the program. Every time in practice, the crowd would go nuts. The flexibility on that spiral is beautiful. seemed as though she felt that she was too close to the wall and broke out of that triple loop too early. Has to get right back into it on this triple sal, double toe.
tired legs on that second triple lutz. It's such a big jump for her. And when you're tired, it's so hard to go that big. You have to be smaller, like skipping stones. Perfect. 14 pairs of boots in four months, though. I'd say that's pretty darn good. That's tough to come back from. It's the, very difficult. Because you start to doubt yourself. It becomes a mental thing when well, it's yeah, not. And States. that's really a shame because Karen after nationals, Chen. I thought this next six months, we'd see her soar and her career would really take off. And right now, I don't know where she stands. Trying to take what happened last year, carry it over this season. We'll see Karen Chen, the 16-year-old from California. To advise the artists, The Voice, Monday and Tuesday on NBC. The Western Scores, Shores of Lake Michigan here in Milwaukee. Progressive Karen Skate Chen America continues. The numbers now for Karen Chen. 110.26, which is a new season's best. So you saw 116 and change, she would need to leave the deductions for the fall. Mandatory one point deduction every time the fall. 172.54. And you're always looking for the